So we're here again we're now with Frank Lopez for Negocios en Orlando. And Frank, this was a great event. You had an incoming chair, installment of the new board of directors, full house, uh, wonderful people being recognized for being trustees and sponsors. What can you tell about the highlights of this event, this great luncheon today? Well, I'm, I'm excited about it. I, I think it was a tremendously successful event. Uh, not just because we we sold out, uh, but we, which is obviously important for an organization like uh, like ours, but we had a vibrancy, we had a sense of of uh, a participation, a willingness to collaborate with each other. It is uh, it's wonderful to be here in this event. This is my first major event with uh, with the Chamber of Metro Orlando. Uh, Tremendously successful, I think. Uh, it was the right kind of leadership uh, messaging, building on the legacy of the chamber over 24, 25 years. Uh, the incoming chair, Carla Muñiz, spoke very eloquently to this new inclusiveness, this new sense of direction of continuing to build on our legacy. Uh, so I'm excited. I'm excited about that opportunity. For me, it was like, uh, you know, again, the first big event uh, of the Chamber of the Year uh, that I have a chance to be presented and speak to the, to the membership at large uh, about this new direction, this new mi mission, this new openness to work together, collaborate, and to uh, it, it sort of do that as a means of, of growing, uh, of building, of expanding our footprint and our presence and our influence. So, Excellent. And where to? Uh, how about the trustees that were recognized, the sponsors? Can you tell us a few of them? Oh, well, Walt Disney, obviously, uh, a, the, the PSAV, uh, a, a Florida Hospital, Orlando Health Universal, uh, a, the, the range, Wyndham Worldwide. Uh, a, I, I mean, I, I don't want to miss any of them because there were many, but I'm excited about the kind of corporate business collaboration that's represented here. Uh, uh, just about every major, the Magic, uh, Orlando City, I mean, uh, uh, the OUC, uh, Duke Energy, I mean, uh, you name it, Telemundo, uh, and, and, and just about every uh, significant corporate participant uh, in the region uh, is connected with us, and they were here today. And I need to recognize those that make our work possible, and in this case, uh, this leadership installation was uh, made possible by our Paramount sponsors, which include PSAV, include the Shingle Creek, uh, the, the Rose and Shingle Creek, the host of the, of the event, Walt Disney. Those three are tremendously important partners of ours. In addition to that, we have Pinnacle Partners or sponsors from uh, Florida Hospital, Wyndham, Magic, uh, Orlando Health, uh, and uh, the, La Compañía de Exportación e Importación de Puerto Rico, uh, que también está bien activa con nosotros. Uh, the premier sponsors include Universal and Lista, or USTA, I'm sorry, which is uh, the Tennis Association, has a major presence here. Our corporate sponsors, people with tables from Central Orlando, Leeds Group, uh, the, the affiliated groups that we have, Induce, uh, and, and then the media partners. We have a significant number of media partners, Spectrum, Telemundo, uh, Channel 9, I mean, uh, uh, woo, El Venezolano, La Prensa, Sentinel, uh, están ustedes eh, con, con nosotros también Space Coast Channel está eh, qué más está bueno eh, I heard uh, eh, bueno I can show you Sentinel I don't want to miss anybody but yeah please there's La Nota Nuevo Amanecer Nosa Gente El Sol Oceola Star Venezolano uh, Clear Channel Outdoor and Channel 9. Yes, right. Thank you. Thank you, Frank. It's a great group. You have a lot of support in Orlando and best wishes to you in your new endeavors as incoming president. Okay, thank you for your support. Have a great day. Para Negocio en Orlando, José Luis Rivera con Fran López. El presidente entrante acaba de iniciarse hace unas semanas de la Hispanic Chamber of Commerce of Metro Orlando. Gracias de nuevo. Gracias. We're here today with Lourdes Mola and Carla Muñiz outgoing chairperson and incoming chairperson for the Hispanic Chamber of Commerce of Metro Orlando. And we're glad to have you again with Negocios Orlando. What can you tell us about your year? What are the highlights? What are you very proud of? Oh, uh, there, it, it was just an amazing year. First of all, we were recognized locally and nationally by the Florida um, Chamber of Commerce as well as the United States Hispanic Chamber of Commerce. So that was it, in itself 
what an amazing uh, way to for for our year to end. In, the, thank you, thank you very much. Also, we increased our membership by almost 30 percent, and that's attributed to all the great programs we had. A supplier diversity program a very active advocacy program where we educated our members on the issues that were affecting businesses, giving them access to elected officials and making sure that they have those candid conversations on how to um, create more economic vibrancy in our community. So it was just a fantastic year overall. We're excited and we know that there's even more ahead with Carla Muñiz at the helm. And quick question, how many members now? We have over 1,700 members. That's wonderful. Congratulations for a great job. Saludos. Bienvenido de nuevo a Negocio Orlando. We're here today with Carla Muñiz, incoming chairperson for the Hispanic Chamber of Commerce of Metro Orlando. And Carla, we here that left you a great team and a wonderful membership of 1,700, right? That's right. That's and, right. And what are your plans? What can you tell us about the key highlights of your plan for the incoming year? Brent, wonderful. Well, so we are excited that we have strong seven, a membership of 1,700 um, individuals. At this point, our major focus for 2017 will be to continue to expand our footprint, especially targeting Seminole and Osceola County. At the same time, taking a really close look at our programming, some of our signature events, Business Expo and Conference, also Latin Food and Wine. We want to definitely make sure that this year they have a different new a new look and feel. Also, this year we're celebrating the 20th annual Don Quixote Awards. So it's definitely going to be a night to remember. And what's the next event coming up so our viewers can attend? Yep. The next event that we're actually uh, starting the planning for is our business expo. Um, the ex we're definitely having it in the summer and very much looking at the lineup of what are going to be the topics that we're going to cover and at the same time our keynote speakers. ¿Está como en español? Hablo español. Mi familia um, y yo nací en Venezuela um, y emigramos a este país cuando era una niña. Pues felicitaciones en su eh, ser escogida y electa chairperson. Eh, queríamos para los hispanos parlantes también que nos dé unas palabras en términos de, en general, eh, primero, la compañía que usted representa. Uh -huh. Sí, um, yo trabajo para el Hospital Florida Hospital y, y ahí tomo el cargo como directora de uh, talento. So, mi, res mi responsabilidad es la estrategia y todo lo que se trata en cómo uh, um, reclutamos nuevo talento al hospital. ¿Y ¿Qué tiempo lleva en Orlando y qué tiempo lleva con la cámara? Bueno, en Orlando desde niña uh, crecí en la comunidad de la Florida Central, me gradué de UCF, también uh, hice una maestría en Rollins. Tengo eh, trabajando para el hospital más de 15 años. ¿Y en la Cámara de Comercio Hispana de Metro Orlando? Sí, mi tiempo con la Cámara ya actually tengo 10 años con ellos y en la Junta Directiva de la Cámara tengo más de 6 años. Pues muchas gracias, Carla Muñiz. Encantado haberla tenido para Negocios Orlando y mucho éxito en su gestión. Muchísimas gracias.